Welcome back to Pop Around Channel. Today I'm going to share with you my shrimp cake recipe. Very easy to make, easy to eat, you're gonna love it. Don't worry about it being quick flashes, I have added full list of ingredients and instructions in the description as well. You can just easily toast one or two slices of bread, tear it and throw it in the food processor, and you'll easily get breadcrumbs like this. For the mincemeat, you can just throw all the ingredients in the food processor, mince it well to get a firm and bouncier texture. Put the skillet on high heat. Once it's warm, turn the heat down to medium-high heat. Now we can add vegetable oil. As you can see that I use very little amount of oil because at the end, when it's all done, it's a pain to get rid of the leftover oil. Make sure the oil is hot enough but not smoky, then we can start balling up the shrimp cakes. I'm not too bothered about coating my shrimp bowls with flour before the rest of the process because I'm happy with the level of crispiness from my shrimp cakes without it. If you're not going to consume all of it in one go, you can just put the rest of your shrimp cakes in an airtight container or just cover it with cling film. They can be kept in the fridge for two days before losing its best. If you want to ball the meat with your hands, don't forget to dip your hands in the water before doing so for a less messy result. Or you can just use two spoons like me, be creative and have fun! Wait a couple of minutes or until golden, then you can flip and repeat. When it's done, you can dip it in sweet chili sauce and enjoy it with steamed rice, or just have it as an appetizer. It tastes amazing, you're gonna love it! Hit like, share and subscribe to get notifications for new videos. Bye now!